Hello there and welcome back to my videos. In this video I want to speak about the Amazon web service called Cognito and I will in this video show how we can uh, sending the, the forgot password and how we can uh, confirm the forgot password based on the confirmed code and a new password and then, then I will show how we can take uh, access token from a previous video and used to change the the right now password to uh, a new password so we can log in with that in, in the future that's what we're gonna learn today and uh, I really hope you want to stay with me the full video and don't forget to subscribe you can click on the right corner below and click on the thing and then you will want to subscribe to this channel if you have any questions please make a comment below I'll try to answer you and uh, let's go ahead and code the first function we're going to do is a uh, response here and called forgot uh, password from the the, uh, the, the bottle tree and then we need the client ID and we need the username. Username will be here in the variable ops here and will be an sh that's my and then we need the get in v we need the environment variable called the user client id and uh, then we want to send a response code out here so let's see how this is working and about it's uh, working we get the response and it's going a little bit and then you will receive the email when you ping up your own email here so let's go into for the confirm forgot password. Let's copy this code here. And then we are ready for the username. And confirmation code is equal to confirm code will be here. And then we need a new password. Let's call it the password. Just put password here, and the password will be a b b three four. That's fine. That's the password, and everything here should be nice. I only need my confirm confirm code, and that's all found in my email right now. And copy and insert it. When I found it, I will insert it here, and. We will do the same and let's see about how this is working and see about it. we get the right one. We need the client metadata and uh, we have some error here. Uh, the password because we don't type the right function confirm forgot password let's try again and see if we get a new one now it's confirmed and the password is now changed so that's working x exact what want in the in the response here you can read a little bit you can cover the response if you want and I don't go in deep for the response code right now now we are ready to change the password so let's going inside here copy the code and insert it and uh, for, we will need the the access token I'll take the access token from a previous video and copy it inside so we don't need to spend time so if you don't have the access token you need to see the previous video about how you can log in and get out the, the access token so that's what I'm going to copy now and insert it I will uh, paste it in here and uh, then I'll just see a little bit here and password uh, new password and previous password and just the previous password and I'll go up to see one two three four that's fine as I'm saying, it's still a testing uh, testing password, so it's not, not working in the real world. 
So what I'm gonna do now would be the previous. Then we say proposed a new password, and then we access tokens equal to and then we go. Let's see about how it's working here. Change the password and see about we get everything here. I'll just it's password. I need to think about the right one. Uh, and we don't need the client ID. And then we go. Now the username is uh, not the username, the password is changed right now. So that's how it's working. Thank you uh, to have you here. And I really hope you enjoy and know how this is working and how we can use it in the future on your own project. If you have any questions please make comments below and don't forget the code will be released on the github of course and the link for github will be in the description below and I really hope you won't subscribe by clicking on the thing in the right corner of the video below and don't forget to like and share this video. Thank you so much and hope to see you next time. Bye!